In this video tutorial, I'm going to walk you through on how you can create a PayPal account that you can use to send and receive money here in Nigeria. And basically, the normal PayPal account that we are used to in Nigeria, you can only create PayPal. PayPal only allow you to make pushes. That is, you can buy things online, you can send money to other people, but you cannot receive money back here in Nigeria. That is the restriction we have. And this affects a lot of affiliate marketers and bloggers and those who do business online who want to receive payment since PayPal is one of the easiest way people can actually make transactions online. So I'm actually going to show you in this video, walk you step by step how to create a PayPal account that you can actually start receiving money and equally send money um, while you are in Nigeria. So if you're a blogger, if you're an affiliate marketer, or you have any business that you're doing online, this video is best for you. So what we need to do basically is to follow the links that displays on the screen. All you need to do is to go um, to paypal.com forward slash is slash home. And then you click enter. You can see the, the this, um, web address displayed on the screen that is the web address you are going to type on your browser so once you type in all we just need to do once it brings us to the paypal um, website that you are looking at on the screen now we just need to go ahead and sign up here for a business account so all we need to do is to sign up for a business account and when we sign up for a business account that will enable us to actually send and receive money um here in nigeria so instead of choosing the personal account go ahead and click on the business account that is what we want to create once you follow the web address click on the business account and click on continue so here we are on the next screen all we need to do now is to input in the email address to get started we input in the email address um, that we want to use for our PayPal account. So just input in your email address that you want to use to send and receive money. And once you click on that, please make sure that you are not using a previous email that you have used for PayPal already. So this has to be a new email entirely. So you go ahead, type in the email and click on next. So on the next screen here is where we need to fill in our details, your email, your password and then your business name you need to fill in this information correctly for the phone number please fill in your nigerian phone number don't fake this fill in the address everything has to be accurate let it be where your business is located in nigeria so go ahead and fill in and for the currency um leave it as the us dollar and then click on and agree for the terms and conditions before you continue please once again make sure that the information you are filling here is correct your business name your phone number has to be a nigerian phone number your own personal phone number and the address has to be where your business is located or wherever you are in nigeria leave the default currency as a us dollar and click on agree and continue now on the next screen you need to tell paypal about your little about your business so you are going to choose a category from the drop down uh, mine, in my own case, is going to be a non-profit. There are a list of categories. Wherever your business fall in, you are going to check that and continue. Mine will be non-profit. And whatever category you choose uh, corresponds with the next fields that will be coming in that you have to fill. So all I just need to do is fill in this, uh, this form, put in your keyword, choose your location your business location should be nigeria and the date it was established fill in this information correctly and then all you just need to do please on the category choose whatsoever that corresponds to your business or whatever you are doing and put in your country as nigeria put in the keyword fill in the date of establishment where the business or whatever you are starting was established and after this click on the continue button to go to the next page so once we get to the next page all we need to do is now to fill in um, the nationality you need to identify yourself um, 
in Nigeria, and I'm going to use my own uh, means of identification as my driver's license. I fill in the driving license, and then the date, my date of birth, you fill in everything. And I decided to use the previous address, my business address. If you have a different address, you can go ahead and add up your home address here. But I decided to use my uh, previous and uh, my business address. All you do fill and click on continue to go to the next screen. So here, depending on the information you've provided, the survey you are going to take here now correspond with the information you've provided previously. So all we just need to do is to follow up this instruction that PayPal is giving us. If it is a yes, give it a yes. If it is a no, give it a no. So go ahead and follow in this instruction. And I think there should be about three questions or there about for my own category. And then in your own case, it may be different, but all you just need to do is to provide the right answers to the question being asked. Um, a yes, no, and all those kind of things. Just choose whatever that corresponds to the business or whatever you are doing and go ahead, read the instructions carefully. And once you are done with it, go ahead and check the answer that is right for you. And after that, you click on continue. So here we need to certify and submit our information for the business we've created with PayPal. So all we just need to do once you read the instructions carefully and you agree to the terms and conditions, just certify and then submit this form. And that will take us to a page where we need to confirm our email address um, with the confirmation code sent to our inbox. So that is it we have signed up for a business account for paypal and then a, a confirmation message or email has been sent to the email we signed up with so we need to go to our inbox and then confirm that email so all you just need to do go to your inbox click on the first email to open it up and click on the confirm confirm your email button and that will be just it so once you click on the confirm you need to log in with the email and then the password you provided when you signed up so once you log in this is your dashboard as you can see that uh, and then have a withdraw funds button which is not available in your normal paypal account so i can send money I can withdraw money, I can receive money here in Nigeria using PayPal. So this is the interface of your PayPal account. You can see that you can send, withdraw your funds and that makes it easier. So that is the difference between this PayPal, this business account and your normal account. So go ahead, link up your card, create a PayPal account and you can start receiving and sending money using PayPal here in Nigeria. So you don't have anything to lose anymore. Thank you and see you.